Golf Shoes for Golf Beginners When playing the game of golf, you will need to wear golf shoes. These specially designed shoes have spikes on the bottom. This is to help keep a grip on the turf when swinging the club. Traditional golf shoes were leather and had a dressy design. The spikes were made of metal. In recent years, metal spikes have been banned on many golf courses. This is because the metal spikes can easily tear up the delicate coarse grass, especially on the greens. The newest types of spikes are made of rubber material and are called soft spikes. These are allowed on all courses. Golf shoe spikes are made to be replaced. If you have metal spikes you can change them out to soft spikes when needed. A spike wrench is an inexpensive tool that can easily remove a spike from the shoe bottom. So it can be replaced with another type. Almost every major athletic shoe company makes golf shoes for both men and women. They are available in many different styles, and from many different materials. Those who play mainly on private courses, may prefer a more traditional looking shoe. These work well with the stricter dress code at many of the clubs. You can also find golf shoes that are styled like athletic shoes. These are more casual but may also be more comfortable. When choosing golf shoes comfort is a major consideration. Look for shoes that give good support yet are lightweight. The heavier the shoe, the more tired your legs will be at the end of a round of play. Always try on golf shoes before purchasing them. You need to be sure that the fit is perfect. Shoes that are too large or too small can cause blisters and foot cramps during play. Try the shoes on with a pair of socks similar to those you will wear on the course. Try golf shoes on at the end of the day rather than at the start. Our feet tend to expand during the day, so it's best to get shoes that will fit at that time. When choosing between two sizes, always opt upwards in size. That way your feet will always fit comfortably, even at the end of the day. Shoes that are slightly large, allow room to add gel insoles that may help keep your feet comfortable during a long day of golf. Choose golf shoes that breathe well. Man-made materials are often too hot especially after walking in warm weather all day. The soles should be stiff enough to give support, but flexible enough to allow comfortable walking. If you want to purchase golf shoes over the internet, first, go to a local shop and try on the specific brands and styles you like first. Golf shoes are available at a wide range of prices. If you don't golf too often you may prefer to get shoes in the low to mid price range. Since golf shoe styles change, you may find that you want to get a new pair each season or every other season. Balance, stability, flexibility, and comfort. Golf shoes actually have a wider base and larger sole than other shoes designed for athletics. Since golfers spend a lot of time just standing in front of the ball, they need more stability when they swing the club than other athletes who are running and jumping. Golf shoes even have lateral arch support to a golfer's feet from sliding back and forth during their swing. A golfer's domain is one of the hills, varying height turf, irregular fairways, and hazards that are hidden by the rough. Golf shoes have to be pliable and able to conform to awkward surfaces much more than other athletic shoes, which only need to conform to manicured or flat surfaces. A golfer in the course of a normal round may walk as much as 6 miles. You wouldn't want to do that in an uncomfortable shoe. Golf shoes are designed to be comfortable even when walking long distances. This usually means extra padding and a soft breathable footbed. Breathability and weather resistance. Whether it's dew, high heat, light rain, or wet sand, a golfer's environment is hard on shoes. Most golf shoes are made to be weather resistant or even waterproof and breathable. To handle these tasks they may be treated with special coatings, or have air holes permeating the upper part of the shoe. Golf shoe care is important. After each golf game be sure to clean the shoes. Remove any dirt and grass from the spikes, and clean off any dirt from the uppers. You can keep your golf shoes in a small golf shoe bag to avoid the spikes tearing into anything. The debate. So what is the debate? Are spikes or spikeless better for your game? I'm going to wade right in and tell you that spikeless is the future of the game. 
newer designs that use the height of technology to provide traction and support, are going to supplant older cleated shoes in much the same way that plastic spikes replaced metal spikes. In our environmentally friendly, green, society, we don't want to cut down a tree and we certainly don't want to chew up the greens. Go green and buy a pair of spikeless golf shoes to take care of your feet, and the environment all at the same time. Many golfers prefer to have two different pairs of shoes, each with a different type of spike or cleat on the bottom. Remember that most golf courses will not allow you to play in street shoes. Check with the golf course before you arrive to determine the type of spikes they allow. I hope this information was helpful. If so, please hit the like button. And for the best golf shoes and golf apparel, click the link below. Thanks for watching.